Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is the biggest, biggest shopping haul I have ever done in my entire life. Um, it is all from Princess Polly, and since I am moving out to California, I um, had no work clothes at all, and I am working at just Fab, so I'm working at a fashion company. And I definitely need to step up my clothes game and look more professional because literally all I live in is jeans and joggers and running shorts and gym shoes. So I was like, okay, I definitely need something else in my wardrobe that is more professional for this job. So I went on a huge shopping spree and found so many cute things and I'm so excited to show you guys today. So I'm just gonna jump right in and I don't wanna talk anymore because I'm so excited. So this is the box I received from Princess Polly. This is the biggest box of clothes I have ever gotten in my whole life in one order. So I am so excited to rip into this right now. This is so exciting. I love getting new clothes. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to try these on. There is literally so many, I, don't, I think there's like th over 30 items in here. I got like boots, um, different sandals, different tops and bottoms, so I'm super pumped. The first item is this bodysuit, it's like a leopard bodysuit. I think it is so, so, so cute. The material's really stretchy and really, really nice. I don't know if it's like spandex material, Honestly, no, it's polyester. Just made that up. So, but it literally feels like spandex shorts. Like it's super stretchy and it fits really nicely to your um, body and it hugs your body. And um, it also does give you a little lift in the boob area. So you don't need to wear a bra with this, which I really, 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 really like. So, because I just don't like wearing bras in general. So anything that will give me a little lift is really, really nice. And I also like the thick straps because I don't like this part of my arms. So it covers that and it's really nice and I don't feel insecure in it. It's super flattering and I love it. This next item I will be wearing with every single top ever. Um, these jeans are the best things I've ever bought in my life. They are so, so trendy I feel like I don't know I just, something about them I just really like and they look so good on so um, they have pockets on both the sides they have two pockets and they are not fake so you can use them yay that's really exciting I always love that because I hate fake pockets just kidding the top one is fake but the bottom one is not these also are real up top and then there are real pockets in the back as well. It's like not super skinny, but it's not also a mom jean. It just kind of like, it's not a boyfriend jean, it's not a mom jean, it's not a skinny jean. It's like in between a skinny and a boy, or in between a skinny and a mom jean. So um, honestly, however you want to categorize this pair of jeans, but I love these jeans. They look so, so, so good on and they look good with any top. I also do really like the wash of these jeans. They're not too dark and they're not too light. I definitely needed something like that, so that's why I purchased these. This top is super, super cute. It's this little white, let me fix this, hello. And I really like the thin straps and how it ties at the shoulder so you can adjust it to however, However high you want it on your body or however low you want it on your body, whatever whatever you're feeling that day, you can definitely readjust it, which I really like. And it does have like a built-in kind of cami into it, which is really nice so you don't have to wear a bra with it. And I definitely would not recommend wearing a bra with this just because it, it's already kind of tight in that area. So I like adding a bra to it will just make it even tighter and you'll kind of look stuffed in the top, I feel like. So, um, but it's really nice, super flowy. And I think it'll be perfect with high-waisted jeans. You can leave it untucked, you can leave it tucked, like whatever, whatever you're feeling. This next top I absolutely love. It is this long sleeve blue and white striped button down. Um, I have been looking for a top like this for a really long time with a color that I really like because there's a lot of colors out there that I just like don't like in certain shirts. And um, I didn't want this to look like a flannel. It looks super beachy, which I really like. And you can pair this with jeans and you can either leave it full length, you can tie it up in the front, you can tuck one side in and leave one side out. This top literally you can style any different way, which I really like. And I also bought it in a tan color as well because I like the shirt so much. Here is that top in this like sandy beige kind of color, which I really like as well because I would probably wear the blue one with white jeans and this one would go with like denim blue jeans. This next top is perfect for work. I absolutely love it. It is like a turtleneck sleeveless beige top and I've always wanted kind of like a sleeveless top like this but never find anything that's flattering or cute enough 
that I really, really love that I want to purchase, but I did find it on Princess Polly. It is amazing. The material is so, so soft, such good quality. And what I would wear this with, honestly, is um, like white shorts or I would do it with denim jeans. Um, you could tuck it in. You can leave it out, honestly, however you want to wear it. Um, but this is the softest top ever, and I'm really, really glad it's not itchy. I thought it would be when I was looking on the site, but it's not. So love this top. It's definitely a basic simple color that I feel like everybody just kind of needs. This next top I think is absolutely perfect for work. The material is so 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 thick. Um, it's off the shoulder and the sleeves they open at your forearm and then they are closed on the other side. So I just thought this shir shirt, wow can't speak. I just thought this shirt was super unique and um, it's kind of, it's not really a crop top. I mean I guess kind of, but not really. Like you can definitely wear with high-waisted jeans and it'll fit perfectly with that. Um, and then I just bought it because even though it is kind of thick, I definitely wanted to wear it in the office because it is probably chilly in the office during the day. So I thought this would be great for work and I really like this. For some reason, I just really wanted to buy flowy pants. Like I don't really have a lot of flowy pants. I have a lot of tight pants, a lot of like skinny jeans. And I was just like, you know what? I'm not really gonna wanna deal with that during the day. Like it's gonna be hot, I'm gonna be sweaty and disgusting. So I just like want flowy pants that are light and airy. So I bought these like sandy beige pants they button up there's what four buttons and they are high-waisted and then they're kind of like gauchos actually so they kind of hit um where your calf is which is really nice and they are um like a boot cut which is super super nice so i really like that they are so flowy so comfortable um they also do have pockets on the side which is really nice so i really like these and i just need to kind of like a simple Again, a simple um, color to pair with any type of top. Next, I found this beige skirt. Um, I really like this skirt because I don't own a lot of skirts. So I was like, okay, it's going to be hot. I need skirts. Like, don't have any. All I have is pants. And I don't even have cute shorts, to be honest. All I have are cute pants, not cute shorts, not cute skirts, like nothing. I have going out skirts, but definitely not for the office. This is just like a simple beige um, skirt that you can wear with any type of top too. And it does zip in the back as well so it's very flattering and it is high-waisted this next top i absolutely love i'm actually very surprised i like this top because i'm not really a fan of like these type of shirts to be honest um it's a smocked shirt and it also does tie at the shoulders which is really really nice and it's just a very flattering shirt um it does go out a little bit at the bottom, but I really do like that. It goes perfect with high-waisted jeans, and it's great for the summer. Obviously, it's super lightweight material, and um, I feel like you wouldn't really sweat in this because of the smocked material, which is really, really nice. So I love this um, shirt, and I'm very surprised I even like this shirt, to be honest, but I'm glad it worked out. This dress here, don't really know how I can show this to you guys because it's not really tied at all. It is so, so, so beautiful. But the problem with this dress is that it is a high low and the slit in the front is so, so high that um, when you walk, it's going to show your underwear. So definitely not ideal. And I'm really sad about that because I really do love this dress. I'm going to try to make it work somehow, like maybe pin it or something like that. Um, but it is such a beautiful dress and... It's like it ties in a bow on the side and then um, I don't really know how to explain the situation with here, but I really like the, I don't really know if it's like ruffles or what this is, but I really like that going down the side into the back and um, the back honestly almost touches the floor. So I think this would be really, really pretty with heels um, and the arms also do have a little slit in them. So it lays really nicely on your shoulder. Um, and yeah, I'm just really sad about that. So hopefully I can make it work this next dress I honestly don't really know how I feel about it I kind of like it, but I kind of don't like I don't really know what it is about it There's just something about it that like I'm not in, super in love with so I actually might return it Um, but it looks like this. It's like this green leaf and white dress um, and then it ties in a bow in the front here and then it's just like kind of short to be honest It might be a little too short for my work and then it does um, Have like a little slit on the side like by the leg which is I think is really cute and then it does zip in the back as well um, So it's super form-fitting and I just don't know what it is about it And I'm really sad because I really liked it online, but then when it came in I was just like eh, I don't really know 
Um, there's also another lining on the inside of the dress, which is really nice. So um, you don't have to wear a bra with it or anything like that. So I don't know, still gonna decide on this dress. I don't really know how to tie this when, like this is a skirt. I don't really know how to tie it when it's not on a body, but I love, love, love this skirt so much. And it does have a like slit on the side and it does tie on the side as well, which is really nice. And then it kind of has like that tapered um, look to it that it's like a little short in the front. Again, like a high low, just like that other dress. Um, I don't know. I think it's super beautiful and I don't have skirts like this and I definitely have been searching for skirts like this and I'm so glad Princess Polly had them. I will definitely probably wear this with like a white tank top or like a white t-shirt and like tuck it in. I think that could be really pretty. This um, skirt, I actually have the matching top for it and I saw the matching skirt and I was like, oh my God, I love it, but I would never wear them together obviously. But this is like a rust colored um, long skirt and it goes to about like maybe your, it's like a midi skirt, I guess you could say. Um, but it does zip on the side, so it's very form-fitting. It's high-waisted. I really like the material. It's, like, very shiny. Um, and it does have slits on both the sides, so on the left and the right side. I think this is really, really beautiful, and I would wear this probably with, like, a bodysuit or something like that. Like, white, black. I could wear that, like, I could wear a leopard bodysuit with it. Well, I just think this color goes with so many different other colors, so that's why I definitely wanted something like this. I absolutely love these pants. So these are flowy pants and um, they have a zipper in the back and they do have belt loops as well. And But it didn't come with a belt and I really don't think it needs a belt. Um, they are high-waisted. They This material is so, so nice. It's such good quality. And um, it is it does feel a little bit thicker, but since they're flowy pants, like you'll definitely, they're definitely breathable. Um, there is a boot cut on the bottom and I love the white because it can go with obviously any type of top. Um, there is also lining on the inside, like shorts, so your underwear won't be shown, which would be really nice. I am in love with these pants and I'm so glad that they worked out. So I will be wearing these a lot to the beach. Honestly, I can wear them to the beach to work. Honestly, any occasion I think these could like work for. These pants literally feel like leggings. These are the best pants ever. Um, they look like leggings. They feel like leggings. Um, they're not itchy at all. They are skin tight wrapped around right your ankle. Um, there is a zipper in the back and they are a little high waisted, not too much, but just a little bit, which is nice. Um, and this could go with a lot of solid colors. I really like them. I just hope they're not too hot. Um, for where I'm working, but I think it'll be fine. These shorts are absolutely amazing. I love, love, love these because I needed plain shorts like this for work and then to pair with a lot of different colored tops. Um, there is a zipper in the back and then these don't have pockets, I don't think. Just kidding. They do have pockets. That's amazing. Okay, wow, what a find. So, um, they are high, very high-waisted, and the top is very, very form-fitting, but the bottoms, like, taper kind of out, so I really like that. Like, the bottoms aren't form-fitting to your butt or, like, to your legs, so they fit very, very nicely, and they are super flattering, and they are very lightweight as well. This little t-shirt here is super, super cute. It has, like, little ruffles on the sleeves. I'm not a big ruffle fan, so I was very surprised that I liked this top. Um, I just thought it was really cute online and took a shot, so... Um, I don't know, just something about this, like it's very plain, you can tuck it in, you can leave it out, it's a little bit longer, so I think it could look really cute either tucked in or out, however you want to style it, and I really do like the simple beige color, there's nothing on the back, obviously nothing on the front, I think it's just a basic um, piece to have in your closet to pair with any kind of bottom. I got these little shorts actually to go underneath this white dress. Um, I am a little disappointed with this white dress. I thought it'd be really cute for like a festival or something like that. Um, but the problem is it's very, very short. So I'm very upset about that. It did say that online and I did size up a size and it's still too short. So I'll definitely be sending this one back. Um, and I was wearing it, or I'm wearing it with a white bralette, but I would obviously pair it with a black one. I just didn't have one at my house at the time. Um... So I don't know, I like thought this was so cute online. I'm really upset that it didn't work out, but that's okay. Um, maybe next time. This next dress I am really disappointed about because I love everything about this dress except for the length. It is way too short 
and um, I don't know I love the color I love the detail it's very flowy super great for summer months but it's just way too short so I think I'm just gonna exchange it and um, go to the next size up because I really 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 do like this dress but it unfortunately it's just way too short like if you lift your arms up like everything will be out down there so that's definitely not something I want so I'm just gonna have to um, exchange it for a bigger size so I think that's it for the clothes portion so now getting into like shoes and accessories so I did get this silver like double hoop belt and I do have something like this in gold with like one singular circle but I just really like this online and I um, need more silver things. I have too much gold, so I definitely need to switch up my metals. Um, so I found this and really liked it, so bought it and I love it. So I got these black, like, snakeskin flats. I think these are super, super, super cute and I don't even have black sandals like this. So I definitely needed something and I do like the thick band here as well around um, my foot. So I think these are really cute and they're super comfortable, which is key because I need comfortable shoes if I'm going to be on my feet all day for work. So definitely needed something like this. And I don't even have something like this in my closet. So I was like, I just have to get it because it's definitely a basic that you need. I also didn't really realize I kind of got the same thing in like a different shoe. That was really dumb of me. Um, same kind of deal here with the wide um, material here around the foot. And then, but it, this one does have a little bit of a lift to it, which I do really, really like. So it's a little bit different than a regular sandal. It does have a little lift, but not really a heel. So I think that would be really adorable. I got, <laughs> I have a problem with black shoes now. So I got these heels. Um, it is definitely a heel. It's more lifted. And then it's like open strapped like this, which I think is really, really cool. One thing that concerns me a little bit about these shoes is like when I lift my um, foot up, like right here like my toes come out of this portion and like I trip on them so hopefully that won't happen I just need to be more conscious when I'm wearing these to like not do that so um yeah but I really like these and they're very very comfortable and I do like the low heel especially if I'm gonna be walking all day I don't know how I didn't own regular black booties but I didn't I used to but I just like grew out of them and I just like never purchased them since so these are super cute it's not too high of a heel and they're really soft and really form-fitting to um, your calf which I really like and I like how high the um, boot is I don't really like ankle boots anymore I definitely like more like calf boots and it is like a rounded toe um, the problem with these though is they might be one size too small which I'm really sad about like my toe literally hits right at the front So I'm just gonna wear them like once and see how it goes But if not, I'll just like buy another size. I'll buy the next size up But I really really do like these and I think this is a staple for my closet as well So these next shoes I'm absolutely in love with um They kind of remind me of a cowgirl boot. I don't know tell me if I'm wrong But that's kind of the vibe I'm getting but I don't know, I really, really like them and I think these will go great with any type of dress or skirt or pant because they're white and it does have this wood heel and it is a pointed toe, which I really love. And it does have like a rose gold zipper. So I really think that's super cute. Um, but really happy with this purchase. I don't have anything like this, so I definitely needed this in my closet. These next shoes I'm a little worried about, but I love them um, just because the heel is not very thick, as you can see, and it's also high. Um, so walking around them all day at work, you know, kind of worries me, but we'll see. Um, I think this would be great for, like, you know, going out to lunch or, like, dinner with your friends or going out. Like, maybe not out, actually. T I take that back. Maybe going out to, like, dinner or lunch, but definitely um, not something that you'll be walking in all night just because of how the heel is. Um, this is a pointed toe as well, and it does have a gold zipper on the side and is very, very fitted to your calf, which I love. Um, I've been trying to find cheetah heels for the longest time and I'm so glad that I finally found them. So really happy with this shoe as well. Okay, that's it for the shoes. Now I'm getting into accessories such as sunglasses and bracelets and earrings and all of that good stuff. This hair clip I think is adorable. It's like a little pearled hair clip. And then it also does have this gold one down here. Um, I've been trying to get into hair clips lately because I just think they're really, really cute. And if you style them right, they can look super good with an outfit. So there's this hair clip I got. And then I also got kind of something similar, but there is definitely a more, um, small pearl one. And then there is more of these like intricate, cool designs here. So I think those are really, really pretty. These next earrings I think are really, really cool. It is like this, like, I don't know, circle with a line through it. I don't really know how to describe it, but I think they were really cool and I don't have anything like this. So I bought these and I bought these sunglasses. I'm very into um, 
unique kind of sunglasses. So there's like these ones. I think these are really cool. Um, you can wear them. Honestly, I think they will dress up an outfit or make an outfit look honestly trendier. So if you want to look trendy, definitely buy some cool sunglasses and I think it'll pull your outfit all together. So that's that. So I did find this bracelet. It is a gold like cross bracelet. You can see that here. And you can actually wrap it around your wrist twice and then just like readjust it here. But I have no bracelets. The only bracelets I really have is Alex and Ani. I don't wear those anymore. I'm like really over those. So I definitely needed something more dainty and I found this and absolutely loved it. And then I did get silver earrings. Um, these are super dainty. It's like one of those where you put this through your ear and then they dangle like that. So it's like a little little star on the bottom, which I think is really, really pretty. This is focusing. There we go, if you can see that. And then the last accessory I got are um, these earrings as well. And it like they look like this. And I thought these were really cool. Look at me. Like that. It's like two hoops. And then it's like not really, it's like a square at the bottom. So I just thought they were like really interesting. So I just bought these and I think they would look really, really pretty. So that is it for this huge Princess Polly haul. Thank you guys so, so, so much for staying with me through all the talking and the trying on. I hope you guys loved all the items as much as I do. I will definitely be linking everything down below if you want to check that out. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye.